Hey, talking about self-discipline and rewards and recognition used to motivate your team or employees. Um, th this is something that we're taught to do. And it's not necessarily completely bad, but I'll, I'll try to explain that. So, being a leader of a big team, more than likely, especially these days, you're gonna have people that really aren't motivated to do anything, you know? So, uh, we tend to use external rewards, recognition, bonuses, etc., to try to motivate these people to uh, achieve more than they would normally achieve. Uh, but this could backfire. I mean, in many ways, in many ways. Uh, first of all, it's usually a manipulation by the leader, and trust me, I've done this, just to try to motivate. We really don't necessarily give willingly, right? <laughs> you know, hey, give them a raise, give them a coat for whatever. Is that motivating? Temporarily, it's an external thing. Uh, just like the motivational speakers, you know, it's an external stimulus trying to get people to improve their performance. And, uh, and a long term, it doesn't work. And uh, usually as, as leaders, we end up giving recognition and rewards to people that don't truly deserve it, right? These days, you may notice that people will just come to work on time most of the time. And then they expect all the rewards and the, and the raises. And where did this come from? But when I talk about this, uh, I get a lot of grief. Um, but I'm going to do it anyway, right? So the whole thing where everybody deserves a trophy, every kid deserves a trophy. Where did that come from? I, I don't know. Maybe you have some thoughts. But... Uh, Talking to my sister one time, I could not believe it. When I, when my son Dante first got into the Little League, I was shocked that uh, at the end of the year, first of all, we were the worst team in the league, and that's okay. But everybody got a trophy. What they call a participation trophy. Or the coach made up things to try to give them a trophy for. What's that teaching our kids? And how's that affecting society? I think we see it. Not everybody in the Little League Baseball team deserves a trophy. I'm sorry. And when I mention that to my sister, and I love her today, she's like, yes, they do. They deserve a trophy because they went out there and they did their best. I'm like, did they? You weren't there watching these kids that had to be controlled, controlled by the parents, controlled by the by the coach to, to even get off the bench to do anything. Now granted, a lot of these kids were there because their parents made them because they were living through their kids and I, you know that's a whole different story, but uh, they didn't deserve a trophy and what does that teach them? Okay, so they do a terrible job, they don't try at all, they don't wanna be there, yet they get a trophy. Ooh, so that means in life they don't have to do anything, they get a trophy, so that, leads to the work situations that we have today. Entitlement. It's all, I call it, do-gooder philosophy. It feels good to give everybody a trophy. It does. But uh, if you're doing it for wrong reasons, or if you're doing it because somebody didn't do anything, I mean, like I said, people at work expect a raise, and they've told me this. I'm like, well, what have you done above and beyond? You know, your, your, uh, your duty. Well, I came to work on time. And I go back in their records and hey, they have it all the time, right? In fact, they missed more than they should have. They should have been terminated years ago, but we couldn't find anybody, so we kept them. Um, so they expect these external rewards in order to motivate them. And if you do that, you have to continue to do that, continue to do that, and it, it doesn't come from the heart. You don't really mean it. You're just trying to give it to them to motivate them, and it's not a long-term fix. Only self-discipline, and I've got the, you know, definition of self-discipline in the writing. So, curious how y'all feel about that. <laughs> the uh, everybody deserves a trophy is not really where I meant to go today, but curious how y'all feel about it. All right, so you just remember, really, now everybody is born of greatness and for greatness. 
They can do that, but they have to try. <laughs> they have to try and earn that reward. Self-discipline, delaying self-gratification. Wow. Immediate rewards. We don't know that term anymore. Uh, well, y'all have a wonderful day. Go get that little life on.